The pandemic has made the importance of PPE clear to many of us, but for healthcare workers, they've always known it's vital in protecting them. We are at Western Canada's first accredited PPE testing lab, making sure the gear is up to Canadian standards. So first off, why and how was this lab created? At the beginning of the pandemic, Vancouver Coastal Health, in conjunction with the Ministry of Health and Provincial Health Services Authority, recognized the importance of ensuring that every piece of PPE, whether it's a mask, an N95 respirator, or a gown, met stringent North American standards. There are so many things that can be tested in this lab, so what are you actually testing for? We're testing for the particle filtration of mask and N95 respirators, the fluid resistance, the flammability, the breathability of it, and we're also testing uh, the fluid resistance for the gowns. Okay, let's go check out these tests. Sounds good. Uh, what we're doing right now is we're using beeswax to form a seal around the respirator so it fits into the uh, containment box because it has to be an airtight system when assessing filtration efficiency. And so this test is, assess is really assessing the material respirator itself and how well that filters out uh, aerosols. And how many times would you perform a test like this on each mask? There's different, uh, different protocols and different test methods, so it really depends on what the end user is going for. It could be a few samples, it could be up to 20 samples, or large production lots, it could be uh, beyond that. So this test is one of the standard test methods for medical masks uh, that we assess the fluid resistance of. And so it uses synthetic blood at fixed pressures to make sure that the mask is not going to allow penetration of blood. And what we do is shoot it with two mils of synthetic blood. And as you can see, looking at the mask, it hits the mask and we look for penetration of synthetic blood. Looking at the back, we do see a little bit on this sample. Okay, so this station here is for, it's called quantitative fit testing of N95 respirators. So this test is to ensure that respirators will form a good seal on your face. And so this containment area here is to ensure that the aerosol we generate in the corner there stays within the, within the area here. So I will get you to put on a respirator and you can take off your medical mask. So there'll be a series of exercises that, we, that I will ask you to do. And the first step is just normal breathing. So just breathe in and out normally. And so what's happening here is we have two hoses. One of them, the blue one, is sampling the ambient air and that's giving us the particle concentration in ambient air. The other one is attached to the respirator and so that's sampling within the airspace within the respirator and that's giving us the particle concentration inside there. And it's the, that ratio of those two particle concentrations that lets us know how much air or particles are leaking into the respirator. And it's a fail. Your overall fit factor was a five. I failed. So that respirator is not a good fit for you. So to pass the test, you need 100. And I seem to have five. This is not a good fit. <laughs>